Roberto beats in Potomac middle game of a three game set and the Nationals striking early. Three batters in RBI single for me and Sagdahl. Later in the frame, Rhett Wiseman cranks a three run homer to right field. Potomac would have all they would need in the first five batters of the game. Four zip in the second. Sagdahl goes up and out. Solo shot to right makes it five zip. To Myrtle Beach's credit, they would fight back in this contest. First and second, Vladimir Galindo batting in the fourth inning. This should be a double play ball. Instead, Brian Mejia throws it away. The arrow would bring in a run, and the Pelicans within five to one on the board. Potomac would score in the top of the fifth. Myrtle Beach down six to one. Jared Young leads off the bottom of the sixth inning by crushing his first homer at home in Myrtle Beach, second of the season. Pelicans within six to two. Later in the inning, Vladimir Galindo RBI double would pull the birds to within six to three. However, not much more offense tonight for the Pelicans against this vaunted Potomac bullpen. In the ninth inning, man on third, two outs, Johnny Pareda pops up and the Pelicans fall six to three. Multi-hit games from Roberto Caro, Tyler Alamo, Andrew Monasterio, and Domingo. Eric Leal, three strong shutout innings out of the bullpen. And Myrtle Beach tries to salvage the set at 7.05 p.m. tomorrow. It's the start of Braves weekend with a visit from all-star Steve Avery. Also, it's beer, brats, and baseball with buy one, get one Lowe's sausages as well as $2 crackers.